So guys, for the first method, you're gonna head over to search and type in Xbox. Now, you're gonna click on app settings. And then once you're on this, you're gonna scroll down and then click on terminate. Now, you're gonna click on repair. Wait for this to load. See if that works for you. If that's still not working, then you're gonna click on reset and then click on reset again. Wait for this to load. See if that works for you. If that's still not working, for the second method, you're gonna head over to search and type in change the date and time. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna make sure your timing is correct. You have set time automatically turned on. Then you're gonna scroll down and then click on sync now. Make sure that your date and time is fully synced up. And now for the next method, you're gonna head over to search and type in Microsoft Store. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna search for Xbox. Click on it. Now you're gonna find the Xbox app. Click on this. And now if your Xbox app has an update, you're gonna click on update. Then you wanna update it. See if that works for you. If that's still not working, then for the next method, you're gonna head over to search and type in add remove programs. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna search for Xbox. Now you're gonna click on the three dots and then click on uninstall. Then you want to uninstall it. And then once you uninstall that, you're gonna head over to search again and type in Microsoft Store. Click on it. And then once you're in the Microsoft Store, you're gonna search for Xbox. Now you just wanna re-download it again. Hopefully this will not fix your problem. 